Part-time code enforcement officer is the next article, uh, and that would be an impact of five tenths of one cent for the first year, which is uh, really uh, half the year. Uh, actually, salary starts on April one, so it's thirteen less thirteen weeks for the year, uh, and this would be a part-time officer. He would be a code enforcement officer, and he would report to the, under the supervision of the building inspector. Uh, the support of selectmen and the town manager, enforce building codes, zoning, land ordinances, bylaws, regulations, state and federal laws, codes, and administrative rules. I talked with the, the uh, building officer, uh, Kevin. Kevin, and uh, he recommends a part time. Right now, he, as he says, I'm going to have a hard time finding a place to seat him in there. His yeah. office is pretty crowded. What about so two part time with he, no benefits? He is only requesting two one at this okay. time. If we come back later on, you admit maybe next year we'll add an additional one. But at this time, he's only requesting one part time. So we're going to adjust the salary to to reflect a straight that's, salary that's with does. no benefits. That's what it's in there, isn't it? That's, that's correct. Well, Seventeen thousand one thirty six yes. for the first part, first year. As much as I think this is needed, I don't think. I'm going to have to I'm not going to support it for this year. I think that uh, getting, first of all, the master plan get to get going, I think that's really the first step. And I think adding people to start enforcing things. Because I got to tell you, recently, and we just had some more emails in from town council uh, late this afternoon, there's a lot of problems with uh, the way things have gone, just, just the way the status quo of the town things get built you know people look at plans they don't they don't they don't they're not the same as what is actually going on this week I've talked to like three or four different people in various neighborhoods of town that recently moved there and they're new and they don't understand why their plans say something but what is is actually totally different so I feel like getting a code enforcement officer this year is too premature and we need to uh, do a little more work maybe uh, communicating a little more with other bodies of the uh, town government before we just jump into this. See, right I'm, 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 I don't uh, necessarily disagree with you. However, I know Kevin's office has been strapped. Yes. With And so, so maybe some things did get overlooked. But I'm sure yeah, with having the code no, enforcement there. It's no there, reflection on there, Kevin at right. all. And I, I, I know what you're saying, but I think... This would allow him free him up a little bit more and, and free the others up in his office to do the stuff they need to do. Yeah, not just that, but that fire at Foss. I'm telling you, and I've had a conversation with Jason Bichon. Yeah. With these codes, the, these codes when pla when businesses especially and uh, condominium developments, they need serious attention to codes and to building requirements. And the, these buildings have been built, built to the codes. And Are we going around the table, or do we so, have somebody who asks questions at so. will? Thank you. Yeah. So. Uh, what did is Regina finish? Mm -hmm. I'm done. Thank you. Okay. Um, you know, I'm questioning this also this year. I'm just did did, did we do anything? cost analysis or anything you know how much this is this is going to save us in code enforcement and stuff I mean I know we're, we're putting on a part-time guy and we need a part-time guy maybe but do we there's no way of telling that until you actually go out and start enforcing yeah mm -hmm. that's one of the bugaboos to the whole uh, the whole issue yep. is that uh, you can't tell how much work there is out there until such time as you start actually enforcing mm -hmm. now will this person be be hired on a um, at will, is that what you say? It would be a part-time position. Part-time so, position, yeah. but I mean, that could be terminated at any time? It's not a tenured position. It's not a union position. It's not a... Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Right. So, I mean, it's not, he's not signing a year contract or anything no, like that? No, we don't do the contracts. Okay. This is a, an employee at will. Mm -hmm. At will. Yeah. All right. So, he would be, you'd be able to say... Mm -hmm. Our will, his will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And the planning board wants nothing to do with code enforcement. They just put down whatever the description is and walk away. So we have a motion. Also move that we put the part-time code enforcement officer. Second. I'll second it. Yeah. All those in favor? Three. Opposed? Three to one. Good. 